Okay, we're gonna run a test now. Have a full water tank. Light is on, the machine is hot. And we're gonna drain the boiler now. Okay, here's the pump kicking in. That's basically the entire water in the boiler. Light turned off. Pressure went down to zero. Pump is working. Meanwhile, I'll show you some of the parts were replaced. There we go, the light turned on. This is uh, the burned relay Let's see and uh, some of the probes we checked uh, this is the, uh, the plunger for the solenoid valve this little guy over here they got replaced too there we go the magnet and we're just gonna wait for a few more seconds for the machine to uh, heat up again. The light is on, so it means that uh, it's working fine. We'll just we can keep using it, we can pull shots, do all that. I don't know if you can hear this. You can hear the machine heating up. And we'll see steam coming out of the uh, vacuum breaker in a second. And once the vacuum breaker is up, we're going to start having steam power. It's a very exciting news. You know that the machine is working perfectly fine. This is um, basically almost the entire capacity of the boiler. You can see um, how big is this pitcher and going to the size of the boiler, they're almost the same. So we literally drained all the water and you can see that the water level went down here. So the pump and the flow rate is great now until we replace all the parts. In the meanwhile, we can still keep pulling shots because this is a heat exchanger machine. So, besides the fact that we don't have steam because we drained all the water, uh, we're good to go. But uh, even if you're not draining all the water, you can still keep steaming if you just use half of that amount or less. And here we go. We're back in action.
All right, wonderful. Now we're gonna start building pressure. Two seconds. Once the pressure goes up, goes to one bar, 1.5 bars, we'll be good to go. And that's it. Thank you for watching and thank you for your patience.